Today I would like to share the results of the Drulumumab clinical trial on a second line non-small cell lung cancer. The patients were included in the study include the stage 3B and 4 disease and the patients uh, were a, a treated with Drulumumab in dose escalations from 0.1 mg per kilogram to 10 mg per kilogram every two weeks and there was a cohort of 50 mg every three weeks. The safety profile of the compound was comparable with other uh, PDL1 inhibitors and PD1 inhibitors. Um, most of the adverse events seen were related to fatigue and, and loss of appetite. Uh, adverse events related to immune related events were comparable with the other uh, checkpoint inhibitors. In terms of response rate, it was segregated between the high PDL1 expressors versus the no PDL1 expressors or low. The response rate was a uh, 20% in the ones that are high expressors uh, and with an overall survival of uh, 15 months versus a response rate of 10% in the low PDL1 expressors and an overall survival of 5.4 months. With a significant uh, difference. Um, clearly uh, with an appropriate safety profile in a second line therapy for non-small cell lung cancer.